what? Hello, and welcome back to Bird People. We're playing Rocket League again, and this is now what we're doing, Bro Talk? Some Bro Talk action is what we're calling it now, Jay? Yes. Yes? It's yes. <laughs> You're such a good ho- You're such a good cause. Yes. <laughs> well, yeah, you asked like me a one, question, I gave I, you an answer. Yeah, you give Shit. me one- You give me one word answers. Just- I don't yeah. know what else you want me to say. <laughs> Just start the damn match. Uh, find Matt. Oh. Oh. You, what? What? Are you part- Am I party leader? I don't know, you, you try. I think you are. I don't uh, know how. I, I don't know- You invited me, though! Let's see if it works. Standard and snow day. Weird. Uh, oh well. Now we know. Oh well. <laughs> yeah, now we definitely know. So, uh, we're doing this kind of middle of the week, where we usually record Rocket League, and uh... Ooh, are we going to be dropped in? Hang on. We just going to be dropped uh, in. Is it snow day? Oh, snow day. It's snow Yay. day. Yay. Um so so how's your week been so far, Jack? Um not terrible. Not terrible? Anything anything new and exciting you've been up to? Uh that I've been up to? Not really. Um No. I've been looking forward to Thursday cuz that's when I'm going to like I got these this new uh, Star Wars game, the miniatures. Did you buy it or no? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you bought it. I, got, I didn't know yeah, you I bought it. Yeah, I got the starter pack because I'm interested to play it because a couple of buddies of mine play it too. Well, yeah, we were gonna um, go to Heretic and check it out, right? Yeah. I love this. Oh, it's like people are witnessing it. us making plans in the process. <laughs> like. Right. Um, yeah, I'll probably end up getting it at Heretic if it's any good. Are we gonna? Is uh, what? What were they doing at Heretic? Are they doing like a workshop for it or what? No, they just a bunch of people get together and play it. Cool. So that's really all that's been going on this week. All oh, that that's it? You've just been I excited to play uh Yeah. It's X Wing, right? Yeah. Oh nice. Yeah, X Wing I, Miniatures. I wanna Apparently play, it's been out like, for a while. I wanna play I know X Wing's been out for a while, but they also just released Armada where you're playing with the big capital ships. Yeah. And I, yeah, I that one looks really fun too. I wanna, I wanna try that, that too. What? I said I wanna try that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. This, I, it's I, I think it's almost the same game. like I haven't I don't know anything about I, the I games, feel but like it's almost the same, but maybe like more stuff. Oh fuck! <laughs> All right, that was a good goal on him. Just I guess know. he waited. He waited. Yeah, look at that. That was just good. F that guy. Son of a bitch. But yeah, uh, I, 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 yeah, like I think playing, it's almost yeah. the same game, but on a larger scale. Like I've seen like the models. more ships and stuff. Well, like you have, you know, the the star destroyers. I think it also can and be played in tandem with X-Wing. Like, the uh, you can add X-Wings and TIE Fighters into it. Uh, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> well, I, th I think that would make sense, considering if they're both the same game, and they're both two levels of, uh... Oh, no. You know. Yeah. I, it would make sense, but, you know. It would, but, but we'll, I mean, I guess we'll find out. I'm always fans of... I'm always a fan of games like that, though. Like, yeah, where they kind of work together. Yeah, well, and not even that, just strategy, you know, strategy board games in general that involve, like, the managers and stuff like right. that, which is why I can't wait for us to get started, like, actually playing Warhammer, you know, because right. I have yeah, so many plans. I've been looking up, you know, so we talked about Warhammer last time. That's so going in! No! No! Oh, oh. oh my um, god. <laughs> and, and, uh... I know we talked about it last time, but I've been putting, trying to put together this idea for a huge campaign. I've been asking the guys at Apocalypse, and they've been helping me with some custom rule sets. Oh, yeah? Um, because the one planetary expansion rule set is kind of a little too basic. It goes very basic, but also as overly complicated, like unnecessarily complicated rules. You know? It doesn't, yeah. it's, it's one of those things that you look at, this doesn't need to be this complicated. Right. You know? Um, yeah, if the game's overly complicated, I just, I literally lose focus on it. Yeah. So Why is the puck it, stuck on the ceiling? Uh, um, it's it, like, and everyone's just sitting still. What? <laughs> <laughs> that was. Oh my god, that was awesome. There was I've just never dead seen that. silence as we all watched it, like. Oh man, but uh. You know, so we've been- I've been working on putting a long-term, like, multi- No. That was not me! It was the other guy. I uh, know. It was the other guy! <laughs> Dreamers, what are you doing, man? Or was that you? That wasn't no, you, No, it wasn't was it? me. It's Dreamers, see this? I- 
Yeah, I saw you. You didn't touch it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> um. Anyways, uh, yeah. So I've been putting together this long-term campaign with multiple armies and stuff, and it's gonna be kind of fun. But it's also, yeah. you know, oh, yeah. I'm just looking for. You know, it's it's nice that I like to play uh, PC games and strategy games a lot, but I I really want to get into the board game thing just so I get away from a screen every now and again. You know. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. That's kind of why I'm because trying you know, to get into it. Yeah, and my job requires me to be in front of the screen. All the freelance stuff that I do and all that, it's just, mm-hmm. you know, I have to edit things in front of a screen all day. So it's kind of... Well, yeah, I, I know what you mean. I used to do IT. Yeah, well, I can only imagine. I wear, I wear glasses for a reason. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever seen those gunner glasses that they have? Gunner glasses? You never heard of those? They're actually uh, glasses made specifically for people who use the computer a lot. They're tinted yellow so your eyes don't hurt after a long time. Oh... Uh, yeah, those. but they yeah, can be I'm made prescription and stuff. And I'm I've been considering getting them, considering what we're doing plus my my work. You know, yeah. So, oh no! Damn! Uh, if Dreamers had just jumped, he could have gotten that. Um, we're we're totally gonna be shut out today. This is oh, gonna yeah. be great. Um, well, maybe, maybe. Well, yeah. One minute. So what else All are right. you? Anything else? You know, you're uh, you. You looking forward to you? Uh, Deadpool comes out this weekend. Oh, right. I can't wait for that. Yeah, it's going to be oh, a good Oh, come movie. on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, Dreamers, what apparently, are you doing? Apparently Sorry, one of the, uh, a review for the movie leaked from the UK. Yeah. And apparently it's amazing. Really? Yeah. Well, According to this review. I don't, I don't doubt it. <laughs> this one you know, review. It, it's just... It, it seems like an un-Fox movie, un-Fox movie for them to make, because Fox is terrible at superhero movies, in my opinion. And eh, I like same, well, same with Sony. I mean, well, I mean, yeah. I, I didn't hate the X-Men, but all the X-Men movies, I can label them as is, like, it wasn't terrible, you know? Like, I think they should have... I mean, no, they weren't... There we go. Oh! oh! Damn it. Um, I lost tra- train of thought. Yeah, because of the almost goal. Because that block, yeah. Like, I think the X-Men movies were mislabeled. I think they yeah. should have been called uh, Wolverine and the X-Men. Yeah, absolutely. Because I like the movies. I really yeah. did. But I feel like it was mostly about Wolverine. Which, I mean, which is fine, I guess. Huge I mean, you put a lot of money into him. He's, he's got to have a big part. Do you want to just main menu it and go find another match or just ready this? Uh... Oh, just ready I guess it. we're already ready it. Okay. Oh, I'm white. Why am I white? What? Oh, oh, it's because we haven't started the game yet. Like they're they're finding other players. I guess we're just playing by ourselves. Yeah, totally, utterly. Oh, yay! Um, yeah, I think the X Men movies. I mean, don't get me wrong. I think they're definitely supposed to be Wolverine in the X Men, but I think that's also kind of their mistake. Yeah. You know, they needed a main character. When I'm like. First class, I think, does it better where a lot of the people. Yeah, are. I do like the well, the the first class. Yeah. Whoa. I destroyed. I you. think. Oh, punk. <laughs> I like I like the first class movies, but the Age of Apocalypse movie that's coming out, I'm pretty excited for because that's one of my favorite story arcs. Yeah. Any other Any other movies you you're kind of excited for on the horizon? Uh, I mean, Civil War, of course. I mean, other than superhero <laughs> movies, I can't really think of anything. <laughs> yeah, I haven't really seen a lot of trailers that I'm interested in, you know? Like, um, I'll see Independence Day. Oh, absolutely. I, I, I I'll love see that. the first one. Well, I know Sarah won't see that with you. No. <laughs> because um, uh, Sarah is terrified of aliens. And, yeah. And not in a way where she thinks they're real. She just doesn't like them. Um, yeah. So I'll probably just see that movie with you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're, we're totally going to go see that. Yeah. Um, yeah, I haven't, I haven't really kept up. A bunch of new trailers premiered at the Super Bowl, so I have no idea, you know. Yeah, um, strangely, the Ninja Turtles movie, I kind of want to see. I think it might be a little better. It's, it's kind of like, um... Well, there's wanna... only one reason I want to see it. Why? Uh, I, was tell, I, was talking to, I was telling Sarah about this. Like, I feel like it's... It's more 80s. Like, it's the Ninja Turtles that I remember. Yeah, with Krang okay. and yeah, Bebop yeah, sure. and Rocksteady. And they actually and... are putting the real, the old character. Instead of making their own characters, they're actually, you know. Right. I, like, I didn't see the first one. Yeah. I mean, I'm still not a fan. Don't see the first one. Fan. There's no point in seeing the first one. Who cares, yeah. you know? it's It was I mean, dumb. I'm, I'm, not, I'm still not a fan of Megan Fox playing, you know, 
April O'Neil. Yeah, I feel like, she, you know, uh, don't get me wrong. I think she, I've seen her in a few horror movies, and she's actually really good in them. Um, I don't think she's a bad actress. I just don't no. think she's the right fit for April O'Neil. No, person. I don't either. Because she's supposed to be this kind of quirky, nerdy girl, you know? And Oh, hit it in. Thank you, guys. Nice. Um, she's supposed to be this kind of quirky, nerdy girl and not <coughs> kind of this hot lady, but, you know. Right. Yeah. And I'm not sure how I feel about the guy playing Casey Jones. I don't, who's playing Casey Jones? I don't. I don't know. even know what his name is. Oh, I forget okay. who. Oh, I think it's the guy who plays Arrow. I don't know what his name is. Oh, is it? No, he's he's actually a good actor. If it's right. if it's him, if it's him in the TV series, then he's actually really good. You know. So. Well, yeah, I'm I'm terrible about this. Like, whenever movies come out, if it's if if it's a sequel and the character doesn't resemble. A character that I remember from, right. like, in this case, you know, Casey Jones from the first Ninja Turtles movie. Uh-huh. He doesn't resemble that, so I'm kind of miffed about that. Which sure. is stupid. Don't get me wrong. I think it's stupid as hell, but that's just how yeah, my no, brain no, works. Yeah, no, no, but you, you <laughs> like the kind of visual immersion that you're used to kind of thing. Yeah. Um, I, I totally understand that. And that's just something that some people like and don't. I mean, I think, I think with you, it'll come down to what he's like actually in the movie. Because if he can act like it, you have a hat trick in two minutes in, like one minute into the game. Yeah, um, come at me, bro. Uh-huh. You and your shark fin. Um, yeah, but we, you know, I, I think once you see it, it depends on how immersive he is. Oh, wow. <laughs> Those guys were just sitting there. Like, just. Yeah. Oh, I've set it up. I've set it up. Nice. Yes. Oh, that is a good you, assist uh, right there. Yeah, what? Did you see the Super Bowl commercial for the Turtles movie? I watched it online later. Okay. Because, uh, being fair, I didn't watch much of the Super Bowl because even oh, though I'm a even football fan, <laughs> even though I'm a football fan, uh, I wasn't really interested in either team. Um, yeah. Because I called it, actually. It's, uh, my roommate Joe, uh, our friend Joe, I, I called it with him yesterday, and that's another assist by me. Oh, yeah. It, the assisting is so easy in this thing. You, watch, you just go up and just hit it towards like that because it slides, and then there it is. Then you bump it in. Yep. Um, so, what was I going to say? Uh, I, I called it right at the beginning. Is mm-hmm. that... Uh, oh, I was going to get the goal. Um, anyways. so no, We can't uh, fight I amongst it- ourselves. <laughs> I called it right at the beginning of the game. I said, and this is just a little football talk, is that if if the if the pan, if they can keep the Panthers to under ten points at, at the end of the first half, the Denver's gonna win. I said it beforehand, and it, that's exactly what they did, pretty oh. much. So I didn't watch uh, any any of the game at all. Well, <laughs> it was kind of that highly predictable uh, football game where you have a very high scoring offense and a great defense. And it all depends on how they match up, and and um, if it's almost if this if if Panthers can score more than two touchdowns in the first half, then they're probably gonna win. Um, mm-hmm. If Denver can hold them to less than that, then they're gonna lose. Then then uh, sure. Panthers are gonna win. Uh, Panthers are gonna lose. I'm sorry. Um, no, you don't get the only goal that saves you. <laughs> oh, that's no. Hit it, Jay. No! We were shutting them out. No! Oh, it's fine. It's okay. Um, we're up 7 to 1. <laughs> yeah. We're up 7 to 1. I, I think we're okay. Um, oh, good. <laughs> so you don't. I, I, you're, not a, you're not necessarily a football fan, right? No, I, I don't watch football. Like everything you just told me, I know Doesn't what touchdown sense. means. Yeah. <laughs> well, you do the same with hockey. I don't know shit about hockey. Yeah, yeah hockey I follow, but. Yeah, football. Yeah, you're yeah. a Red Wings fan, right? Yeah. yeah. How did you know? Oh yeah, says the guy who's worn a Red Wings hat since as long as I've known him. It's true. Um, yeah, I've had this hat for five years, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. It's about time to get a new one. But you'll have to retire the old hat. That's hey. If I get a new one out of it, sure. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I thought that was in. Yeah, me too. Um, yeah. So, wh- what's with the love of hockey? Is it always just something that's I, I, because mine spawned because my dad played my my dad played football and I played football. You know that well, kind of thing. Well, here's why I don't like football. I feel like they take like there's such little actual play, 
and it it drives me crazy. Oh, like, like all the commercials? No, they well, it kind of they they do a play and then they like break. Thank God I got a goal. Um, you know what I mean? Anyways. They they do a play, they run the football, and then there's like a two minute break between plays, and I get yeah, bored. Yeah, because well, in NFL there is because they do that for because of the mass a massive amount of commercialism that's in the NFL. Yeah, you know when you actually right. watch like college or when you watch other things. There's less of that because it's not – it is commercialized, but they don't have like, oh, every five minutes there's a commercial break. You right. Know? Um, well, be, be that I'm as just, it may. I got NFL Red Zone once because I just watched the fucking highlight reels, you know? Yeah. Well, like I know, I know that's how it is, but I mean that is yeah, how no, it is. Yeah, no, I totally and understand that, what you mean though. That it, can get bores really me. annoying. And you know? what I like about hockey is – I mean, sure, they have commercials, but – those guys are on the ice until the whistle is blown. Sure. Absolutely. Uh, and also, I mean, I get that. I also think that uh, it's hard to explain. Oops. And I totally understand what you mean. Yeah. Um, I think it just comes from, I mean, I love it because I play it. You know, I yeah. played it. And like I I get the stop start because when you're, it's like, nice. with hockey, I, hockey, it's the same thing with ho- soccer as well. It's like, hockey is America. Damn you! <laughs> I no. hate you. That guy okay, ruined he it. He ruined it. He ruined it. That was so oh. going in. Um, so I, I think it's the same with soccer. It's kind of like running a marathon is what hockey and soccer is because you're constantly going, you know. Yeah. But <clears throat> when you add in the constant contact and it's and the, it's almost like doing like little sprints, it kind of equals out to exactly what's happening on the ice as onto the field because. I look at it from a lineman's perspective because it, it's just, uh, it's it's so hard to explain without having it in front of me, and I won't go into a whole diatribe about football. I promise, but uh, mm-hmm. you know, I I totally get that. Yeah, um, no, I get it, but I mean that's that's, you know, yeah, that's I'm the viewer. And oh yeah, I know. I don't I, experience that. Oh no, no, so. I, absolutely, and I I don't expect you to experience it, and I, I'm oh. just saying why I watch it. Damn it. Um. But yeah, I actually love watching. I, I can't, I can't watch hockey on TV. Um, yeah, hockey games are so much more fun. Yeah, yeah. Going to a I hockey can watch game hockey on TV. Just awesome. Yeah, you can watch. Ho- I mean, I'll watch hockey. Like if you're watching hockey when I'm over, I'll watch hockey. It's fine. Yeah, I'll watch sports. Yeah, like watching yeah. hockey solo isn't as fun as yeah. You know, oh, having I just hit someone to watch it with. Oh, um, yeah, I, I get, I get that. Um. You know, but that's pretty much everything, I guess. Sure. Uh, oh, hang on. Well, we, we won, won by a landslide. Um, Yay. And uh, that's about it for today's bro talk. So um, Yay. be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Yes, please. Yes, pretty please. Pretty please. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.